I'm gonna go ahead and ride this uh, wagon here with my son. I'm gonna pull him around and I'm gonna use my electric skateboard. And we're gonna go ahead and see how comfortable it is because I like this part right here because it's kind of like one of those go kart drive strap. Just make it everything easier. You can see, just makes everything easier. Yeah, there's really no resistance on this uh, <laughs> wagon, especially when you're pulling in your electric skateboard. So, definitely the turn is actually better if you compare it to other wagons. So, if you're a dad out there and you have an electric skateboard or just, just a skateboard or uh, one wheel or anything that you want to pull your son, especially um, you just want to ride around and you can actually do it without no problem. You can see how the wagon wheels Definitely. It's no resistance, guys. I mean, I have the controller here in my hand, and I'm just pulling it with it. And I have uh, my camera on the other side of it. And you can see this, you know, without no problem. So right now I'm in a slow mode. It's a bit noisy for what you expect this wagon, but the thing about it is there's a cushion. Definitely, you would enjoy it, I'm sure. Wow. And I'm in a medium mood right now, as you can see. I guess my son likes it. So we can be pulled. see here the roof on this wagon even though it's a little bit breezy it's not like shaky either so so it's fast enough um, if you do have electric scooter or one wheel um, if you're gonna ride this on the pavement with your son I would not put in a in high speed you don't need to go fast on this uh, wagon the echo wagon is actually um, less resistance compared to other wagons so you need you don't need that much pulling and that's the reason why I actually bought this is the fact that, you know, um, it's just, especially when you're riding around with electric skateboard or a one wheel or something, your, your body get tired to it, you know, <laughs> your shoulder, especially with other different wagons. But this one is good. So um, what this really for? I mean, I'm just saying this because this is for me, but I know you're probably going to use it for different things. Um, it's good too i mean if you're gonna go ahead just using it for other things you can also do it too um if you actually watch the full video I actually did more so i'm just gonna go ahead and show it to you guys what else you can do on this wagon for you guys here still cool. <laughs> still cool. wagon is no resistance look at that Grass. Yeah, so. it's like mixed grass and mixed sand, soft sand. Yeah. 
all right guys you guys can see here I actually rode in off-road um, first of all you don't even need to go fast either the same thing what I'm riding on the pavement I'm actually the same speed with my electric skateboard um, I just go you know um, use it low speed or maybe medium but I think I'm in this low speed because it's just so many bumps you know running over this um, I would say little mini rocks or just the, the ground is not you know smooth and by going around so quick with this thing it's just shaky but I had no issue with it and you can see here I mean even electric skateboards powerful enough to pull it on the soft sand and also on the grass basically off-road so um, now I'm showing you guys that one right here and it did it no problem no stress on the electric motor it's bad enough I mean, you got a powerful uh, electric skateboard. You can even go on this uh, sand and grassy feeling to it. Um, one thing about it is also bumpy. So, you know, if you push it too fast, and the good thing about this, it has a slow mode, this electric skateboard, so you don't have to go so fast. And if you're going so fast, you're gonna feel flip back and you can hurt yourself. But the good thing about this is low mode, but it can handle it without no problem. But it's wide tire, definitely recommend it, you know, definitely. So here you go, and he's enjoying it. And I guess it's really comfortable too. So in this wagon, the good thing about it is the fact that, you know, you can actually put this back more. So it has enough room. And that's my son right there. And he's about, I would say it's gonna be two years old this July and um so for go ahead and stand up kai and he's standing up and you can see i mean he's pretty huge for his size but he can actually stand up on the wagon um everything is set i mean in my opinion i think it's good um this thing the way this the way this thing came um one thing is i wish that it could have you know one drawback about this it doesn't have a seat belt and also the cushing here is not high enough that he can actually like sit down on. But for 240 something dollars, almost 250, um, including tax, maybe you can get a better deal somewhere. I mean, the wheels did was supposed to do. I mean, the, I like the way it rides. He actually enjoy it with me when I'm riding this in my electric skateboard. But a few things that I like and I don't like about it is the fact that it doesn't have a cup holder you know and it should have a compartment here especially for you know you're gonna be gonna use this for I mean I guess it's all you not only for kids but for other things but they could at least included cup holder seat belt and I mean everything else is fine I'm not complaining it's just little mini tech that this company could have done you know and right now he's trying to get away on this um, wagon and I'm gonna go ahead and see he's and I guess it's fine so I don't know let me know what you guys think in my point of view for what I'm using it for it's worth it but I just wish just come with a few things especially paying for 200 something dollars you can see here by me just walking around it's actually much you know it's like no resistance almost like this you just need like a little bit of power pulling and you don't need so much power to pull this thing and it was job so you know it was work you see i'm riding it around you see how the the wagon works Grass. Yes, with this job. Surprised. I think this is like the most, I would say, almost perfect for the price and for what you're getting for, especially has that. You know, okay. just turning it up, no problem. And even though when it goes in the big bumps, 
clearance you get from a big bump and then even though you got a big bump here you're not gonna scratch your uh, handle good job 